Hi, my name is Chad Gregory. I'm from Marion, Ohio in the United States. We've got about three minutes for this and to explain everything that happened to me this week would take months, literally. If you've ever thought of taking a mission, this is definitely one to do with Pastor Wayne. He's the most humble, God-fearing man I've ever met in my life. And by the grace of God, I happen to happen to accompany such a man on this journey, powerful and humbling journey. And trust me when I say you won't regret it one minute, not one penny spent. Giving is, uh, giving is what you need to do in your life to stay graceful, to stay humble. Everything you do, from the people you meet, the people in the group that you connect with, just the people of Haiti alone, yourself, you'll be fulfilled with joy, love, and happiness. Pray about it. Let God be your planner. Let God decide your, your path of righteousness. Have a blessed day and safe travels with whatever you do and whatever you decide. And you, Pastor Wayne, may all of your hopes and dreams come to light, my friend. As a matter of fact, they already have. I see those children playing on that playground. I see that church built. I see the crops planted. All them babies with full bellies. I see it. God's there. May everything in your life be humble and true. By the grace of God, my friend, I love you. Thank you. Hi, my name is Tanya and I live in Marion, Ohio. And this is my first mission trip to Haiti. Um, I've always felt like I've had a mission-minded heart, um, but I never knew quite where to go with that. Um, locally, I've always been involved in missions type work um, where you give and um, I just always felt like I needed something more. Um, so coming on this trip was a huge blessing, a uh, huge opportunity, and I was humbly blessed by um, funding that I didn't even know, from people I didn't even know. And um, that just really humbled me, and my family all just kept telling me that you know, this will change my life, and, and everybody kept saying that you come back a lot different than you went into this thinking a little you know some of us have a little bit of an ego thinking we're going into a um, destitute land um, and we're going to just do all this wonderful things but they don't really tell you that all the wonderful things that happen to you and just seeing the humbleness of the people here and the situations that they live in but the love that they still have for us is just unbelievable um, one of my Facebook postings, someone mentioned that it was a great joy for me to be able to love on those children. I said, no, it was even a greater joy for them to be able to love on me. Um, so if you've ever had a desire, just a little twinge at your heartstrings to do a missions trip, I highly recommend it because you will leave a much better person than you came into it.